Hello guys, welcome to how to fix tag. In this video guys, we are going to fix this issue. Boot device not found. Please install an operating system on your hard disk. The hard disk code is 3F0. So this error occurs mainly in the HP laptops. So let's fix this issue guys. So fixing this issue is very easy. You need to just shut down your laptop forcefully or the system. So press and hold the power key for almost 15 seconds so once your laptop is completely turned off just you need to turn it on and press the escape key continuously so let me turn on the system and I will continuously hit the escape key like this so that I can get the BIOS option now you can see I got the BIOS setup so I have to press the F10 key as shown on the screen so this is the F10 key guys so this is the F10 key so I need to press this so in here guys you will see the options like this so we need to go to the configuration so use the right arrow key here this key the right arrow key you need to use to navigate through this way and go to system configuration here and once you go to the system configuration go to the boot options and hit enter so once you go to the system configuration and then click on boot so go to the legacy support and simply enable the legacy support here and hit enter click on yes option with the right arrow key now it is enabled now you can see and make sure secure boot should be disabled and after that we need to press F10 key here to save and exit so let me press F10 key click on yes now once you press F10 key and exit the save changes will take effect and now you may have to enter the code here so let's see if the code appears on the laptop screen or not so you need to make sure whatever the code it is showing you have to enter that so let me enter the 2469 here so 2 4 6 and then 9 and I need to hint, hit enter now okay now the changes will take effect after this changes and your issue is going to fix now now you can see window has been loaded so if your issue is solved then well and good if not we need to go to the again bios option and we will load the setting to the defaults if legacy support is not there on your laptop or system we have to change it to the load default settings or the factory default settings so both are same we have to change that now let me now F10 and go to the exit option this time guys and load setup defaults and hit enter and click on yes option again and now exit saving changes and this will restore the setting into the defaults and will fix the issue if legacy support was not there and any configuration changes during your setting changes or the hardware changes and after that guys you may have to again enter the code if any if not your issue should resolve and you are good to go if the issue is still persist we have to run the hardware diagnostic test of the hard drive or the ssd make sure our ssd or the hard drive is okay in some cases if ssd or the hard drive is failed so you may get this issue as well so we have to replace the hard drive so before that we have to run the hardware diagnostic test 
to make sure that there is hardware issue in the system so how to run the hardware diagnostic test now let me show you once it's start so i will continuously press again the same options so you can see here app 2 is system diagnostic you can directly press it so let me press f2 now memory test it's going so we are going to take hardware hard drive hit enter now select quick test and let it run short dst test in a progress and a smart check is passed you can also run the other component if anything wrong with your other component also so it's going to take one minute so let me pause the video after waiting for one minute you can see smart check is passed and short dst is passed so make sure your both tests are passed here if anything is failed you have to replace the hard drive guys it is as simple as that so click on backspace the menu if the both tests are passed here you may have to reinstall the fresh window if nothing is working guys so let me exit here so yes enter so this is how guys you can fix the issue so hope your issue is fixed now if yes then hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching how to fix tech